Alright. And we are back with the medic. He who has been lost. I think I've pretty much decided at this point that medic is probably going to be my character. Um, for a couple of reasons. One, just overall as far... Because it's like, I haven't gotten to experience healing necessarily to the same extent on all three classes equally. However, I have just gotten to play them, and you have to enjoy the class on your own as well, like, you know, leveling it, otherwise it's not going to be that great of an experience. And between the Esper, the Spell Slinger, and the um, Medic, I think I've had more fun on the Medic, though the Spell Slinger was a close second, but we already have other people playing Spell Slingers within my circle of friends, and I don't want to overcrowd with one class. So Medic will probably be my personal choice. Not to say one class is superior to the others, maybe you really dig the Esper, and if you do, more power to you. I'm just saying what my personal choice of the matter is. So we'll get to see how it goes. So let's do some stuff on the medic. Let's, let's, let's. Oh, how was your egg salad sandwich? It was, uh... I don't know. Okay. Only okay? That sounds pretty disappointing, bro. Yeah. I was hoping it was gonna be everything you've ever wanted from a sandwich. What a no. situation. Hmm. I wouldn't call that living, then. We should probably just call it quits here. Okay. Goodbye. No, wait. I need Wildstar first, then do that. Wildstar. I also really like the sound effects for the medic for some reason. Like, actually, I guess visually and, um, fucking, like, auto, audio, I guess. I don't know. I really like the sound effects and the visual effects for the medic. Something about it. it feels very sci fi ish. Do you know what I'm saying? Oh, I know what you're saying. Brown. Slide them all, Seth, like common nerds. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yes. You did? Yeah, I did. The deed is not your nice. Yeah. It is nice. That's why I said it. That's all I say is nice stuff. I see. Yeah. I'm glad you're seeing shit. 
just one second nerdy thing to say, but okay. You know what? The reason I said I'm surprised you're seeing shit is because I figured you would need your glasses. <laughs> mm -hmm. I need my hearing aid too. <laughs> At least you don't need Viagra. Nope. So, you know, it could be worse. We're going back to town real quick because I need two Venda. So, now that you're a fucking billionaire, have you had any chicks trying to get on, on that sugar daddy money? Mm-mm. I usually don't tell them. Uh, you're going for the Chappelle, Dave Chappelle thing, where he's like, I want women to like me for me, so, you know, I'm gonna show up for the date in a fucking trash can. Or garbage can or whatever. Hell yeah. I got a lot of decorum items, or decor, whatever, items on my, uh, medic. I got a tabletop, or a tablet computer. I have a hover hammock, which I'm actually kind of, like, curious to see what that looks like. And then I have a, uh, Cranock fence. <laughs> Oh, and by the way, did you hear about, remember how we were sitting there trying to figure out the, uh, the deal with the, um, ba -ba -bum costume stuff? Mm -hmm. It's something you have to now do at a dye vendor. Yeah, I know. Uh, in the last patch you were able to type slash costumes and it would bring up the interface and you could put them on, but not with this one. Ah. Uh. Well, fuck you. Alright, sorry about the delay. Let's get out there and let's kill some stuff. Damn, I like this chest piece I got on. I really like leather chest pieces that have kind of, um, like a tunic, I guess you could say, like, look to them. You know what I'm talking about? Mm-hmm. Cause I'll be bowling, bowling. I said the hip hop, the hippie, the hippie to the hip hip hop, you don't know, or you don't stop. I've ruined it.
Yeah, this is like so big of a difference compared to my Esper. Like my Esper's literally only a level or two behind this guy and just with what I'm doing as far as like soloing shit and just the amount of mobs I can pull without like worrying about dying. Mm hmm Actually, I just did a group quest and I didn't, <laughs> I didn't realize that was a group quest. That's funny. Like, uh, I was pulling, like, packs of mobs, and I pulled the group mob, as well as a couple others. Done. After all, I can't be expected to solve all this planet's mysteries. Way to go. I live just fine. If you were a real friend, you'd be watching my stream, hanging on the edge of your seat, with anticipation and excitement of my awesome. Is that how it works? <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, reading abilities still. Seth, God, we've been through this, bud. I know that you want to fit in with everybody else, but we all know you can't read. Whatever, bro. You got special powers. I am Jelly. Just call me part of the X-Men. I am Jelly of your special powers. I wish I had special powers like you. A new X-Men movie comes out pretty soon, doesn't it? Days of Future Past? Uh, end of this month, I believe. I imagine you're gonna go check that one out, yeah? Mm-hmm. Nice. For sure. Man, I don't know. Fucking, I was so bummed, because when I was working, like, there was the Thor movie came out, and the fucking, um, uh, the Hobbit movie came out, and, like, I was actually bugging everybody of, like, hey, does anyone want to go see this with me? I'll fucking pay your way and everything, and, like, just no one's interested and it's like, God, I hate my friends sometimes. Mm -hmm. They'll spend their money, like, to go fucking buy some booze or shit, but if it's something geeky, they want nothing to do with it. Fucking nerds. Exactly. They're talking about, um, this is like off topic kind of, but uh, they were talking about uh, outlawing pit bulls here in Washington. And I was like, my dad asked me, he's like, so if that happens, are you going to get rid of your dog? I was like, nope, I would either fucking hide him or I would just move out of the state. There's no way I'm getting rid of my dog. Yeah, I don't blame you. That'd be bullshit. That's a new one. Got a report for me, do you? Good fortune in safe travels, mate. You know, I was talking with somebody about this before, but I really dig the telegraph system in this game more so than a lot of other games that have done it previously because a lot of games like ESO and to a lesser extent Final Fantasy from what I've experienced at the lower level stuff, most of the um, the telegraphed abilities are your kind of typical fucking, you know, not necessarily, obviously this is an over-exaggeration, but 10 year wind up ability that gives you ample time to get out of it kind of thing. But Wild Star, there's a lot of shit that's like almost fucking instantaneous. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have a nice uh, differential on, the, like, the speeds and shit. It's not all the same. Mm-hmm. I really like that about it. 
And there's a lot of different kinds too. Like it's not just this is a fucking line, this is a frontal cone, this is a circle. Like there's the thing where you get the uh, one that I've seen a lot that I think is kind of interesting is the uh, circle that will start to appear beneath you and it travels with you and you can slowly see it like charging and so what it is is like the mob like burrowing underground and it pops up but you have to like keep an eye on that as well as the mob as you're running around and I thought that was really cool and then I fought a mob just now that it just started fucking slinging out circles all over the place because it was doing this weird kind of like whirlwind thing that is pretty dope yeah so, I'm kind of actually happy, though, because I've pretty much made my decision. Very nice. Very, very nice. Now, all that's left that will be decided for me is what faction we go. Because if we go Exiles, I'm pretty sure Mortish can be um, Medics. I'm like 90% uh, sure they can. Oh, not that mm -hmm. quest. I don't want to do that quest. I tried doing this quest before. Yeah, Mortish can be everything but Espers. Oh, then fuck yeah. I, I'm okay with that then, because I can be a Mortish. I like. I really dig the Mortish, but that's like the only cla or race I dig that much on the uh, Exile side. Like, I'm not big on playing the cutesy thing, but nor am I big on playing like the overly macho thing, like the rock guy. But I'll probably, if we do end up playing Exile, I'll make a Orin like spell singer, and I'll make a uh, a Garnock or Grunok or whatever they're called um, engineer. You again. Yeah, I was trying to do this recalibration thing before, and I kept fucking it up. And I really just don't want to sit here and waste the time on it again. So, we are not going to do it. Catch and return these little buggers. We'll go do that. Actually, what do we got for quests? Might get rid of some of these lower level ones, see if we can do some higher stuff. Oh, I saw the capital city, by the way. Like, have you seen the capital city for the Exiles yet? Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I was going to say, I, I saw it uh, last beta weekend, which is where I got the screenshot of the mounts, and then I saw the capital city for the Exiles earlier today, Ilum, ironically, which is that it's called, which is funny, because that makes me think of SWOTOR. Even though Ilum really didn't get visited that much. No, it did not. I liked Ilum. Like, it was cool, but yeah, it was really only that one section that you ever found, PvP. I did my dailies there, though, because uh, that was the only way to get some gear at first. Like, if you were trying to just get into the door, basically, get your foot in the door. Every time I think of the whole, like, telegraph and skill shot thing, I keep thinking of Total Biscuit's video where he was talking about Smite and saying that, oh, I feel like this limits them so much, and it's like, I feel like that's the complete opposite, you know? Mm-hmm. No, I'm with you on that for sure. Like, I think not having that really limits you when it's like, oh, fucking, you know, I don't know, maybe it's just me. Well, like you said, yeah, but you know what I mean. I don't know. I like Total Biscuit, but at the same time, I feel like he's a bit of a whiner. I'm with you there. Yeah, because he was, uh, I guess, at that thing you got, what was it called? YouTube or Gamescon or something? The thing that was in uh, conjunction with the uh, Smite launch tournament. They, uh. Mm hmm. Gamescom. Yeah, I know that he. There was this big press conference apparently about how he was saying that he was fed up with some of his fans and uh, pissed off with a lot of his fans and shit like that. And, uh, there was another video where Rooster Teeth was talking about it. And Bernie, you know, the founder for Rooster Teeth, basically was saying, yeah, I kind of agree with him though. We're pretty fed up with his fans too. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I don't know how you can really say that, though, because it's like, you realize that you wouldn't be where you're at if not for the fucking, you know, the press that you got from having such a big fan base. Indeed. What is this? Chua Tech Loading Arm? That's a decorum item. I wonder what that is. I hope I get that. Huh? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Big money, big money, big money. Yeah, I got it. Nice. It was a, um, a challenge reward. I need to get to 15 on my medic. I think I'll probably just dink off on my medic for the rest of this beta weekend. Girl, you are gonna die if I do not heal your ass up. Hopefully Agor uh, gets his comp by the time the game launches, that way he can tank for us and he won't have any like lag issues or latency issues like he was when he tried tanking in Terra. That's fucking right. I really do hope he gets his thing there before too long. Uh oh. Mm-hmm. Lag? Okay. Lag. I thought for a second I was going to get kicked off server again. This road, oh, dude, I love this chess piece, this is so ballin'. Is that be bow and is that a skull? I'm pretty sure that's a skull on my chest piece. Yeah, I think that is. That's awesome. It's funny with the Makari, you can like hear the sound effects of uh, like the machine as they run around. Settler's pretty ballin' though. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Like, I want to go explore because that's more of my thing and I'll have a lot of fun with it. However, like, I kind of want to go Settler because I feel like that would help the group. But if you're going to go Settler, then I don't feel like I have to. Yes, I'm 100% I'm going Settler. Okay, maybe I'll yeah, do... That's not even a debate for me. Damn, I am getting, like, crazy lag. What the fuck? Like, big lag, at, lag spikes. I am sorry for this video, peoples, if it's coming through like super duper laggy. I don't know what the deal is. I was really bummed to find out that the, uh, like I had that big long video of me and the other guy two manning that five man group quest for the Spider Queen. And just like it was epic and hectic and crazy and just like really intense and fun and the uh, the file for recording that was corrupted and I was so bummed. Oh, that's so shitty. Yeah, I was really bummed to find that out when I was like making my uh, medic playlist on my YouTube page. I was like, oh man, that sucks because it was such a like cool thing to see and yeah, ah, it just sucks. 
Mm-hmm. It's like I'm messing around with the customization, like trying to figure out what I would want to do. Like, if I got this person, because there's like a bunch of hairstyles that I like. Bunch of different ears that I like and all that kind of shit. But Wait, what are you trying to figure out now? For what, like, what race? Like how I would customize my character for the Orin. Okay. Like what I would end up choosing. I really like, honestly, like I think I would choose the spiky, the spiky one, if not for the stupid like hair barrette automatically being in the hair. Yeah. I think I know which one you're talking Fucking about. Big it, heart one. Yeah, I know which one you're talking about. It reminded me of like kind of like punkish almost. Yep. Yeah, like it's just super spiky. Like it looks like a you know like Super Saiyan almost. Whoa. You know, like Raditz or some shit like that. Leg. Yeah, I think there's there's three different hairstyles that I like that I would choose from. There's a couple different colors. I don't know what I would do, honestly. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I like I like I said, I made a video where I went through and did all. Oh, this lag is pissing me off. I might have to stop recording. Um, I don't think it's on my end though. I think it's server end. Probably. But uh, I was gonna say, yeah, I did the video where I went through like all the customizations, including the female. And there are a couple like the female. Uh, customization options aren't as bad as in some other games. Like, I feel like I could make a chick that I would be happy to play. But, um, yeah, I don't know. They're, they had some cool ones, and yeah, I think I said the same thing when I saw a couple of them. I was like, oh, that's the Super Saiyan haircut. Mm-hmm. Uh, what about if we end up, uh, going Dominion? What would you go? I don't know yet, honestly. I was gonna say, it'd be one to check out just in case. Because I've pretty much looked into what I would pick if I go Exile, and looked into what I would pick if we go uh, Dominion. That way I got my bases covered. Probably just go Cassian, honestly. Not doing that one. But we gotta return, so we'll do go return. I don't know, you can make some pretty cool looking dragons. Dragon females. Since I imagine you are trying to make a female. But yeah. I guess Cassidy would or whatever they're called would be your other option. Sounds kind of like you're in the boat that I am with the other faction. That you're in that same boat with the Dominion of like, you don't really care for a lot of the races for it. Yeah. One of us will be disappointed come launch. Yeah, it's like the race, the fucking, the one that I really like, um, fucking, uh, Dominion is the one that can't be fucking Spellslinger. 
Nah. -uh. Oh, the yeah. uh, Makari. Yeah. That's funny. Yeah, I'm playing a Makari. Um, I don't know actually. If we go, if we go Dominion, I'll probably be a Makari um, medic, and then if we go Exile, I'll be a Mordish medic. I do like the Makari though. They're pretty cool. Mm hmm. Hmm. Catch and return escaped Ravenock. The fuck is a Ravenock? It's nice to be able to swim underwater in an MMO again. Fucking, I thought that was so weird with ESO. How they like put what would look like really cool stuff to explore in the water, and then like you can't fucking dive down. Mm -hmm. That was so weird. <laughs> Every time I think of like water or whatever MMO underwater gameplay and fucking breath bars I think of crunch dr uh, drowning twice when we were playing vanilla cause back then that fucking shit was so much shorter and if you didn't pay attention and it's the, the funny thing was it's not like he drowned like in some big ocean deep underwater it was in the fucking um oh god what was it uh in the barrens you know those pools like kinda close to the um whaling caverns those two little lakes with all mm -hmm. the turtles in them. He drowned in those. Twice. That is great. Shit was really funny. What the fuck is a Revenock? I bet it's like a little thing that I'm missing. Nice boy, bro. I don't know what a Revenock is, Seth. Help me. Help me to understand the world. It's a, it's a Revenock, you know. Oh, well fuck, why didn't I think of that? Yeah, now totally, dude. You know, you know that about that Revenock, right? Yeah. It's like there's a quest for a D2 thing, the such and such, and fucking I remember when doing that, like, I couldn't find the mobs for the longest time, and they turned out they were like little critters, basically, you know, like uh, equivalent to a critter in other MMOs, and fucking just like these little rats, and I was like, god damn it. I just know I have <laughs> Don't you love when that happens? Nice, I got a recipe that's entitled Now You're Cooking with Insects. It's a cooking recipe. <laughs> I do still really dig the humor of this game. I've laughed quite a bit while playing it. It is pretty dope. Okay, so I guess they're along the shore and I gotta use the bait to lure them out? I don't know. Yes, you must be a master baiter. Mm, there you go.
I'm gonna fuck this quest. I don't give a fuck about the Revenock anymore. Or that one. Would you do me a favor and check to see if like this video is coming through really super laggy? Because like I keep having these lag spikes and I'm worried now that my frame rate is dropping super hard. And I don't like to alt tab because for whatever reason, I, a lot of times I've noticed the videos that I alt tab end up getting a corrupted video file. Hmm. What am I looking at now? Like, just tell me, is it like super laggy, basically, and is it watchable? Oh, okay. I'm trying to heal you, man. Don't run away when I'm trying to heal you. It seems to be fine thus far. All right. I don't know what the deal is, it's like I'm having these huge ass lag spikes and Alright, oh, that's all I wanted to know, as long as it's not too bad. I really need to go and buy a, an adapter. They're like six bucks if I order one offline. Or online, I should say. That ain't bad. Yeah. Because I need to either get a DVI-D to VGA adapter, or a mini HDMI, HDMI to VGA adapter, one or the other. Kill. Oh dude, are you still on that or no? Did you already close it out? No, I'm still on your stream. I was going to say, that's the Spider Queen. Try to get a place. Oh, you're going in the cave right now. Okay. Oh, cool. Yeah. She's all got like the spiky shit on her back. Yeah, she's pretty awesome. She's a bitch too. She fucking hits pretty hard. I wonder if this dude's gonna do it. I'll heal him if he does. Actually, I don't got enough. I don't want to reset all my bars. <laughs> I'd have to put a bunch of healing stuff on my bars to two-man that. It is such a bitch. So, she's boned. <laughs> she said invite in zone. Mm. What am I doing in here anyways? Oh yes, I remember. I love the sound effects for Maddox, man. It's so awesome.
need to retrieve webwood larva. I see no larva. This game is full of shit. I guess fuck this quest too. Moving on. Shit, they're fighting it. Oh wow, there's a bunch of people in here doing this. That's it. Yeah. I wish I had my other heal on my bar, I could heal this dude more. Dude, there's a lot of people in here. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm surprised how many were there. And I tanked. Item dying. Costume slot. Gear slot unlocked. I can now have shoulders. Oh, and housing. Sweet. I'm going to town. figure out how the hell to get to Elm. Alright guys, I think I'm gonna hearth back. I will find my way to Elm on my own and I will catch everybody who watched this. Again, thanks. Uh, later. Bye.